Bienvenidos, Freight fans, and welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Jaime in Fuego, and we are at Mad Monster 2018, the fifth straight year of our coverage here. We could not be more excited, and I'm honestly a little intimidated because of the sheer size of this guy standing beside me. You know who it is. It is none other than Ryuk from Death Note, man. And uh, I'm going to say what's up to this badass cosplayer. With whom am I speaking, sir? My name is Ryuk the Shinigami. Well, this I know already, but uh, you've obviously got some cosplay skills, my man. If you want to keep your identity like Batman style and secret, that's cool with me, though. No, no, no. Hey, no. I appreciate it. Um, Sexy Maxi Papi, all with eyes. Instagram, S-E-X-I, M-E-X-I, P-A-P-I. So have you done this uh, garb before at a previous convention or show yeah, or anything yeah, like yeah. that? I, I usually stick to Texas. No kidding. Is first, that where you're from? First, yeah, first time in uh, Arizona. Very nice. We're in Texas, man. I San know it's Antonio. a huge ass state, so. San Antonio. San Antonio, yep. That is what's up, dude. Mad Monster is pretty much the creme de la creme, or the blood de la blood, I should say, of the Arizona horror convention circuit and stuff like that. So, uh, obviously, you saw my response when I saw you yesterday, man. But what what's like the best response you have seen to this costume from anybody? Fear, elation, or, or I like... almost made somebody drop their food, <laughs> and I was like, felt bad about it. But also felt a little good about it, you yeah, know? Yeah, it's like vindication, it's like, validation, man. It's like, this is why we're here. <laughs> this is why I put this thing together. So how long did this take to actually assemble? Uh, about a month and a half, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And did you do all the work yourself, or did yes. you outsource some assistance from some other people? No, yes. Uh, yeah, I did all the stuff myself. Uh, I made the stilts. Um, I made the mask. Um, I ordered the gloves, so I cheated there. <laughs> but other than that, that is everything else I've made, yeah. Very nice. Well, I think you did a damn good job, man. So what was your first uh, exposure to Death Note? Was it the manga? Was it the anime? The anime. God, God forbid it wasn't the movie No, recently. no, no, no. <laughs> it, it was not. I, I saw the movie after, unfortunately. What, what were your thoughts on it? Because obviously it was a very Americanized, Cliff Notes kind of interpretation of the things. The voice and... was great. Mm. And we're the talking, voice you know, was great. And we're talking Willem Dafoe, and that's yeah, about everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Aside from that, yeah, I just could not, I, I couldn't get into it. And I know they've made multiple movies over in Japan in the live action variety as well. So they, they have. And, and how it, are those in your opinion? Um, I, I, I've I, seen I, one of them. Yeah, I, I like the uh, the other versions, yeah, but not. Unfortunately, we I think we strayed too far from the story um, in an attempt to make it its own thing. But I mean, I liked it too. I mean, it's not. I, I didn't dislike it. I just have a preference to the uh, the anime. Yeah. Nice, nice. Well, the anime is about as iconic as it gets, man. And I mean, blending, blending humor and you know, obviously like deep mythos with you know, just just the when when I first learned the sheer concept of the book and you know, just how specific you can get with somebody getting killed and all of the ramifications that can come from it and everything. I mean, it's it's some of the best anime and or manga. I mean, just just Japanese storytelling. Period, man. It's I great. Love it, it's love great. it, love it. So we always like to jump into another sort of horror question, like. Um, have you always been into like scarier stuff, or is it like more of a recent fascination or something? It is. It's a, it's a it's a recent fascination. Okay. I mean, I've had the pleasure of having like great friends that have brought me in, um, and I'm just hooked now. Nice. What's just something that you saw recently you, you really dug? I'm sorry. What's something you saw recently maybe that you really dug? Um, you know what? I'm looking forward to the new Halloween movie. It seems to be going around. Yeah, it's, I'm just it's catching. I, it's spreading. I, I, I may have pissed myself a little bit when I saw the trailer. So, <laughs> Well, I mean, we had it 20 years ago with H2O, so uh, we'll see how this stacks up in comparison. In so. excitement. Yeah. Piss myself in excitement. Is there something that scared you as a kid that you iconically remember that just kind of stuck with you? Ah, uh, as a kid, man, I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't remember what scared me, but I know Fre Freddy was always, like, the go-to, yeah. you, you know, don't do this, this is what happens. I was all scared of Freddy, man. But he's a great guy. I just, you so, know. So, so did you get to meet England at the convention then? Yeah, I just yeah, I just uh, just passed by, and he's, he's, he's super awesome. He's an icon for a reason, man. Yeah. But you know what? This is iconic as well in its own right at this particular point. And I know Wingard was wanting to make multiple movies. I don't necessarily see that happening at this point. But, hey, you know, I mean, it, 
that remake doesn't take away the awesomeness that we had seen before, in my opinion. And I mean, people see Ryuk, bro, and they just they, they freak out, and with good reason. And you did a damn good job. Props Thank once you. again to this amazing cosplay. And let's just hit them one more time with your social media, dude, so peeps can uh, can take a peek at anything else you might be doing down the pipeline. Sexy Mexi Poppy, all with eyes. Sexy Mexi Poppy, there you guys heard it right. We are going to have more coverage coming at you here at Mad Monster 2018 in the near future. And until next time, Fright fans, stay scared. That means stay scared. Bye. Bye.